Hello, I hope you guys are having a great day. Today we're going to go to Tinkercad.com to do our circuits and our coding. So let's click on designs on the left hand side. And then on the right hand side, we're going to click on the blue button, the plus sign, and we're going to choose circuit. Let's just rename our project right away. So what we're doing is we're using a breadboard with two LEDs. So let's start. Let's get our micro bit with breakout. And I'm going to use the rotate button to rotate this. I'm going to get a breadboard and I'm just going to use the small one. We need two LEDs. And we need two resistors. So let's start by hooking things up. We are going to connect the ground to the negative and I'm going to turn that black. I'm going to take my LED and you can change the color here. I think I'll change this one to yellow and I'm going to put this in 19 and 20. So the positive is in 20, the negative is in 19. We're going to use pin zero to code the first LED. So I'm going to change this to yellow just so we associate that with the yellow LED. I'm going to take my resistor and I'm going to put that in row 19. The resistor serves as a bridge between the two sides of the breadboard, but we also have to hook this up to the negative. So I'm going to click here and hook this to negative and I'll change it black since it's associated with the negative. And now I'm going to connect the yellow wire to the positive leg in row 20. Let's do some coding and let's see if this works. So on start, you can choose anything that you like. I'm going to grab the forever block and go to output. I'm looking for the digital right pin zero to high. I'm going to grab another digital right pin and I'm going to change that to low. I'm also going to put a weight in there. Let's test it. All right, my yellow LED is working. Now we're going to add in our second LED. So let's put the green LED in rows 24 and 25. The positive will go in 25, the negative will go in 24. We're going to take our resistor and we're going to cross the bridge here. The resistor goes in row 24. It does make a difference which way the resistor is turned. And we're going to hook up pin one to our second LED. So I'm going to drag pin one to row two. And now I need to connect row two down to my positive leg on my LED. Let's look at the code. As you can see, our green LED is not lighting up. So let's code this. I'm going to grab an output and go to digital right pin. But this time I'm going to change it to low. And then I'm going to change pin zero to pin one because this is going to be associated with the green LED. And now I'm going to get digital right pin, I'm going to leave this high. Let's put a weight in between all of the digital right pins. Okay, I'm missing a wire. So I'm going to connect the resistor over to the negative side and I'll turn that black. Now let's start our simulation. And as you can see, they're blinking at different times. So have fun creating and have a great day.